this is my traditional tip number one. For those of you that are new to coming to the Trident Team Lab Mass or those that have been even coming for many years, I've noticed that sometimes people forget to stay silent before Mass. Actually, they're actually pretty good at that, but they'll prepare, they'll be silent for a really long time before Mass, and that's great. Usually, every Trident Team Lab Mass will have a somebody lead the Holy Rosary beforehand so people can prepare prayerfully, but I do recommend that you pray on your own to prepare for the great holy sacrifice of the mass before mass and then afterwards this is the part where i see most people aren't doing it so much anymore is you should give time and thanksgiving after mass because you've just received our lord fully body and blood soul and divinity within your body you're so close to him physically and spiritually at that moment and I notice a lot of people as soon as the priest is gone and the choir has stopped singing they just get up and they start going I highly 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 recommend the if you don't have anything pressing that you need to get to that's greater and more important than Jesus Christ <laughs> then then really take that time and say any special prayers or devotions that you have at that time that you haven't prayed yet for the day. Uh, I, 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 if you see this quote here, St. Alphonsus Liguori says, there is no prayer more agreeable to God or more profitable to the soul than that which is made during the Thanksgiving after communion. So think about that. I challenge you all to consider how you behave before mass and after mass. And do, do your best to take advantage of the opportunity to have that you have with our Lord direct line after Mass. You, you don't have to spend an hour after Mass, but even just giving him those extra prayers. If you need a time for you to say your three Hail Marys, that's a great time to do it. Um, if you have a devotion to the Sacred Heart, great time to, to say your Sacred Heart prayers. Um, if you love the Golden Arrow prayer and you say it before bed on Sunday after Holy Mass, do that after Holy Mass. These are just some suggestions that will really help you to to really gain all that you can from this the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass. Consider when you go to Mass today or the next time you go to prepare properly before Mass and think generously after Mass, and that is in prayerful silence. How much time do we give to God before Holy Mass and after Holy Mass? Do we give conscientious prayer for the great Holy Sacrifice and Holy Communion? Now, if you're not able to receive our Lord, you still need to get yourself to Holy uh, Confession. Well, use that time. Consider using that time in reparation to our Lord and as a spiritual communion. I hope this traditional tip helps. I'm just trying to get things out that come across my mind that maybe I forget sometimes and I need some reminder or I wasn't fully aware of it for a while and it would have been nice if someone brought it to my attention. So I hope this tip helps and may you have a deeper relationship with Christ. God bless you.